all right so the day started early way early than i'm used to the sun hadn't fully risen yet i think i woke up at 6 am in the morning but i was so anxious it felt like i was awake for an hour i got ready packed my bag and double check my white coat the coat by the way was giving me some serious feel it made everything feel so real that everything i walk for the late night studying the sacrifices doubts and here it was in front of me it didn't feel like just a piece of cloth but it felt like a promise to me i remember looking in the mirror adjusting my white coat for the first time and just staring at it then after getting ready i went to mahalakshmi temple as i was going to start my new journey so after visiting to the temple i had my breakfast and now it was time to go to the college so the journey to the college was a mix of excitement and nervousness as i entered the gate i couldn't help but i think this is it this is where the dream begins and trust me the campus was looking way bigger than i had imagined earlier i still remember it was wednesday 3rd of february 2021 where it gets interesting so our first lecture was physiology and it had started at around 9 am in the morning as soon as i entered the lecture hall i felt like a tiny fish in a big ocean there were so many students looking as nervous and excited as i was the atmosphere was buzzing with energy and you couldn't feel that everyone was ready to embark on this crazy journey the first lecture was just an introduction to the physiology and let me tell you it was just an reality check i was sitting there holding on to my notes for dear life trying to make sense of all these new terms it was overwhelming but in the best possible way the professors was so knowledgeable and was so inspiring it felt surreal to be learning from people who have been in this field from years then after the physiology lecture at around 10 we were having our next lecture and that was anatomy so it was just an introduction lecture where the professor started with teaching the general anatomy and i was so focused to all those new terminologies which was spoken by the professors so after this from level to one we had our first ever practical and that was of physiology so being it was a first day it was just an introduction lecture that how the physiology practical goes how to write a journal and what are the things you require for your physiology practical so after the practical we got a chance to explore our campus little bit from the library it looks like something out of the movie to the anatomy labs it was all fascinating now let's talk about the most important part of the day and that is your lunch so i still remember i had made some new friends on the first day of my mbbs journey and i had my lunch in the college mess with my friends it was such a relief to bond over to how lost we were all felt everyone was talking about their experiences and their dreams so after the lunch at around 2 pm we were having our second lecture and that was again physiology and in that lecture we had started with our first ever topic and that was introduction to physiology so this lecture got over at around 3 pm and from 3 to 5 we were having our first ever cadaveric skill lab the first day in the cadaveric skill lab was a significant and a memorable moment for all of us it was just an introduction to human anatomy through hands on learning often sparking to a range of emotions from excitement to nervousness so here's what a typical first day of mine was overall my first day in mbbs was an absolute roller coaster of emotions there were moment of excitement and so also there were moment of doubts but mostly it was the beginning of something incredible i was knowing that it was a long journey filled with sleepless nights and endless exams and of course with lots of coffee but i was ready for it 
and yeah now here i am in my final year of mbbs so yeah here where my four years of journey is going to end now and i'll be soon in my internship so yeah thank you so much for sticking with me on my journey if you are an aspiring med student or if you have already been through this then drop a comment below and share your experiences and don't forget to like share and subscribe and hit that bell icon because there is so much more to come focus on knowledge and keep growing and i'll see you soon in the next one